Hello dear friends, this is Dr. Muhammad Ahmed Islam. Welcome to my channel. In my previous videos, I explained various aspects of column adsorption. In this video, I would like to explain the effect of column adsorption parameters on breakthrough curve and adsorption point. Here is a typical example of breakthrough curve and here it is breakthrough point and here it is adjustment point. So the typical parameters of column adjustment is adsorbate initial heat concentration, flow rate of adsorbate, bed height of column, pH of adsorbate solution, particle size of adsorbent and temperature. Now, adsorbate initial heat concentration. Well, breakthrough and adsorption points are occurred earlier with increasing influent concentration and then break point time decreases with increasing inlet concentration. And this is due to the fact that initially adsorption is rapid because of the availability of large number of vacant sites, then increasing initial adsorbate concentration results in a greater driving force to overcome mass transfer resistance in the liquid phase and the sites are adjusted quickly. So the volume of uh, effluent treated also decreases. Well, then comes flow rate of adsorbate. Well, breakthrough points uh, easily occur faster with higher flow rate and saturation of breakthrough time is increased notably with a decrease in the flow rate. And in this case, the rate of mass transfer gets increased, that is the amount of adsorbate adsorbed onto unit bed height. Mass transfer zone gets increased with increasing flow rate, leading to faster saturation. At lower flow rate, adsorbate has more time to contact with adsorbent that resulted in higher removal of adsorbent in column. Then comes bed height of column. This is very important. In this case, breakthrough and adsorption times are slower with increasing bed depth. And it was found that the volume of effluent treated increased with increasing bed depth. And this is attributed to an increase in specific surface area and the number of binding sites available for adsorption. The time for interaction of adsorbate and adsorbent also increased with increasing amount of adsorbent. Then comes ease of adsorbate solution. It is one of the most important parameters of volume adsorption. In some cases, iced removals are found at acidic pH and maximum removals of some adsorbent are found at basic pH. And it mainly depends on the nature of adsorbent and adsorbent. Then comes particle size of adsorbent. Well, Particle size play an important role on breakthrough and adsorption points. Breakthrough and adsorption times are slower with increasing particle size of adsorbent, and maximum particle size is ever to get better adsorption capacity. However, moderate flow rate is preferred for industrial applications. And Adsorption is a complex surface phenomenon and the extent of adsorption is expected to be proportional to the specific surface area. However, very small particle size is not studied to avoid problems associated with 
solid liquid separation. In addition, the smaller particles develop high pressure drop in the fixed fat column adsorbent. Then comes temperature. It is also an important parameter and breakthrough and adsorption times are slower with increasing temperature of system. However, adsorption capacity decreases with increasing temperature in most cases and it might be due to the fact that high operating temperature favor adsorbent diffusion faster into the adsorbent giving a low breakthrough and adsorption time. And less adsorbent is required to satisfy the maximum adsorption capacity of adsorbent at high adsorption temperatures, indicating an adsorbent process. However, for industrial applications, room temperature adsorption is preferred to reduce heating operation setup cost. And this is a typical setup for column adsorption system. It is effluent tank and this is peristaltic pump and this is column and this is treated water tank. So these are the reference from where most of the information have been collected. And in my next video I will also explain various aspects of column absorption process including uh, feeding column adsorption models using Origin Pro and Microsoft Excel Solver. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe Aminun Cam Innovation, like, comment, and share for new videos.